possibilities of winter. Frozen locks. One of these days I'll uh, remember to keep our propane torch handy. Even if I spray these locks with uh, oil, the water still gets inside of them and they freeze over. There's one. Thanks for hanging out. It's about uh, minus 12 Celsius in the tractor. She runs like a champ. I'll let that warm up. We're gonna hit the backwoods, back that way. We've got some trail maintenance to do. And uh, I'm gonna try, I don't know how successful we're gonna be today, but I'm gonna try cutting some trail. Winter is upon us. A little bit too much snow, I think, on the ground, but uh, time will tell. If I get stuck with the with the backhoe, with the tractor, uh, so be it. But uh, I got some trees to put down, and I got some trails to cut. And uh, join me, and we're going to go have some fun, all right? first hurdle so that's a that's a big down handle hemlock let's see here let me bring you guys down all right you'll look at this he's right across my trail I gotta cut him out and that's only a limb off of that big guy right there. Again, that's from a, a big storm we had here. Not that long ago. I talked about on the last video on the uh, Widowmaker video. So today we're going to we're going to bring out and we're breaking out the Kiati. And uh, we're going to punch through an existing trail. And we're gonna can try to, to we're gonna get started on continuing the trail. I want to get this trail going deeper into the into the woods. So stick around. I'm gonna break out the chainsaw. We'll do some work here. I'm not sure how much bucking up we're gonna do, but I want to at least get through here. Probably gonna leave the rest until next year to buck up and uh, turn into firewood. But at least uh, get what I need out of the way to get through. And uh, it will go survey what's going on on the other side of this guy. Punch through that trail. Let's get the tractor turned around and do some work.
go take a look what's going on at the feeder here. Oh yeah. There's a deer feeder and it's empty and got some pretty good deer tracks right here. Looks like uh, they've been pounding away at this at the snow trying to find scraps of whatever is left. My feeder is well empty, but they keep coming, looking to see what else could be left behind. And some fresh uh, grass pulled up from underneath the snow. Some green grass, not fresh grass, but green grass. They've been clawing and pawing away at the ground here. That's the direction we're heading with the tractor. Beauty day out here. Absolutely beautiful. The sun is shining and the sky is blue. There's not so much as a breeze. Now let's go get the tractor and get working. I got going on so far I'm quite impressed with the way things are going the ground is frozen but the frost has not penetrated uh, into the ground so it's not frozen solid yet 
the frost will drop down to well, as much as uh, on a bad, bad winter, like bad meaning really cold winter, uh, over three feet deep. Right now it's still early season and the top layer is frozen, but not too frozen. I can still bust through it and uh, still grade and do some uh, maneuvering with the tractor. So I'm quite impressed with how things are going. It's slippery. I don't have chains on this thing, but it's, it's managing quite well. So um, let me turn the camera around and we'll survey what I got going on. Now I'm at the point where I got a lot of down trees. I'm gonna have to break out the chainsaw and start doing some chainsaw work. Okay, so hang on, let me, let me turn this camera around. Okay, we came from that direction. This is uh, already an existing road. Like, this would have been a road like a century old road kind of thing. And it's all overgrown. The, the forest has taken it over, but it's still the remnants of it is quite good in that direction. Now, if we turn around, this is where I'm going here. This is where the chainsaw is. Basically, right from where I'm standing, this is the uh, continuation of that road. This is what you've been watching me pounding onto. Just beautiful out here. The little Kiati, you know what? It's a small machine, but it's a beast. All right. Look at this ugly down maple we got here. Lots of lots of windfall over here. So this is at the point where I have to make a decision which direction I'm gonna go with my road. Easy route would be down there, but I don't wanna go too far down there. There's a little creek that flows down there. I don't wanna go messing around around the creek. I'd like to stay further up. And uh, I'm gonna take the chainsaw, start cutting into this big monster over here. And I may have to pull the pin on this until, until the spring. It's too hard right now. It's a little bit hard right now with all the snow. With all the snow that's on the ground, the snow is hiding uh, rocks and stumps and roots. And uh, I don't know what's there until I hit it. So I'm, I'm actually quite pleased with what I got accomplished. I'm going to take the chainsaw to this tree. Because it's a good time of year to do that. Let me get out of the sun here. Sun's in the camera. Love the sun, but the sun is not uh, overly camera friendly, is it? So, uh, yeah, I'm going to take the chance out of this thing, do a little bit more filming, and uh, soon going to pack it in, go warm up, and get a campfire going. Maybe, um, you know, maybe join me later for a campfire. Until then, uh, I'm going to, I might sign off. I don't know. We'll see. Let's do a little bit more chainsaw work and then I'll sign off. How's that?